Welcome back, guys. Long time no see. I know, guilty. We're guilty. It's not been a, even a one month, it's not been two months, it's been more than four months now. We're really sorry about the delay, guys, and I'm sorry about my waist. I've been sick for the past three weeks, but I hope you enjoy it. Someone told me I sound as sexy as Amy Winehouse did. <laughs> Never mind. Anyhow, uh, a lot has happened in the past months, and you know, you guys, we've received comments like, Yo, guys, what happened with you? Are you dead? Like, what happened? Have you been deported? Have you been deported? Did you go traveling? You didn't tell us. Like, where do you guys have been? And you know, I've received like so many Instagram messages and I've tried to reply to all the people that contact me personally. It's been a lot of fun chatting with you guys and you're usually, oh my God, thank, thank God you're fine. Oh, I'm so happy, guys. So, guys, we're fine, we're fine. But life got in the way and some other works and job got in the way of updating the things on YouTube, so... And as you can imagine, opening a hotel in a Smile Island can also be sometimes stressful and there are always more work involved than you think at first, you know, so being busy, like, we opened at October, beginning of October. So it's been how long? October, November, December, January, February. It's been five months. Five months now, yeah. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> so, uh, what happened? Uh, we opened up... Uh, we started receiving the first visitors, uh, we tried to improve as much as we could with, um, with the foods, with the drinks, with everything we did. The very beginning of the, the process of, you know, teaching the people how the thing's supposed to be uh, on like the level that we expected, being super nice to the visitors, entertaining them, doing our best. It took like most of our time. Uh, after that, Chris, where did you go? After that, like a few months, actually a few weeks ago, we came to Europe uh, because we had some work lined up and we just had to do some other things as well, just to keep us going. And as you can imagine, after finishing this project, we also had to have more than one income stream at the time. So we just wanted to be able to continue what we are doing. Uh, and that's why we sacrificed a few, of, uh, few months of our lives, I guess. Yeah, guys, because honestly, we can't rely on YouTube, on Instagram and all that. Online things that we do, we have some other things that we do on the side that keeps us going, uh, some private projects and whatever it is that comes up at a time. So we really had to do that because, you know, as they say, don't put all your eggs in the same basket. Um, if, if you are wondering if you can book a stay in Freedom Society, you can do that. And we are actually right now are uh, listed on booking.com. So if you go booking.com, you can search for Freedom Society container vans uh, under San Isidro location in the Philippines and just check the availability because we've been recently quite fully booked. So just check which dates are available. The prices are very affordable for what it is. It's fully air conditioning private units with uh, private bathrooms. With a, with a hot showers and everything. So just make sure that you go on booking.com and book your stay with us. But you can also visit Airbnb and also search for Freedom Society container vans and just see our listing there as well and book our, the stay with us from there as well. I don't know, it depends which platform do you prefer. Or if you prefer, you can just also visit us on our website, freedomsocietyshirgao.com where you can also check out. You cannot book it through our website yet, uh, it will be available later, but yeah, you can just do that there as well and contact us privately. Maybe if you have any questions about the tours, about the renting any kind of uh, vehicles, scooters, cars, going on a tours or extending your stay and maybe plan a little bit longer trip. I know you guys are uh, really curious about uh, the pictures and everything. So on the website and or as Chris mentioned, booking.com or Airbnb, you can see all the pictures of the rooms and the surroundings. So you see how the final project really looks. Uh, we forgot to mention, you, you guys, we told you that we're in Europe and you're like, what the heck, Europe's big, like, where do you guys, yeah, where are you guys? You can tell by the background, you know, it can be a random apartment, probably. We're in an apartment uh, in Amsterdam currently. Uh, the Netherlands is a place where we used to live before we started traveling and we keep coming back every year for a couple of months. This is where we kind of uh, based ourselves before, before the Philippines, but now we call Philippines our home. So, another thing is, you're probably wondering, because I know I will get the question in the comments, you're wondering who the hell is now right there uh, taking care of the container rents. I'm sure I'm gonna get that one. So, my mother's there, um, she's overlooking 
everything, you know, so that like the safety and that everything goes smoothly. We've got a local partner there as well, who's taking care of all the all the things. So they're side by side, making sure that everything runs smoothly and that everybody is happy and entertained. Also, another thing you're probably wondering, when are we coming back? So the break has been long because we've been doing so many things aside. Currently being in Europe, we are going back to the Philippines at the end of April. So we're staying here one more month, we're staying put one more month till the beginning of April. Then we are going on a three week trip to Latin America. I hope you guys are gonna watch the vlogs before we go back to the Philippines and container vans. Uh, you have to, you really just have to. So we're going on a trip. Then we're coming back and we're taking a flight next day back to the Philippines and we're arriving at the end of April right before the sunny city of Fiesta which is gonna be a big party. <laughs> so guys, just hold tight for a couple of more weeks. Not a couple of more weeks actually, how much that is? Roughly uh, six weeks, seven weeks, two. Well, let's give, it, give us two months because you know with us you never know. And then we're gonna walk you through every single thing and we're gonna reply to all your questions that you have. I know you had many questions about the expenses, the planning, the outcome of the project, how it looks now, what are the things you can do. I know you definitely wanna more, hear more about Shirgao Island as such, if you are potential visitors. So we're gonna cover all of those things and bring you on on the future projects that we have planned. Guys, and in any case you're wondering, how it looks here in Amsterdam, I don't know if you haven't been or if you just are genuinely wondering like what's our life here in Amsterdam, just let us know in the comments and we will make sure that we will make at least one video before we leave because that's in almost five, four weeks now, four weeks now. Yeah. So yeah, just let us know in the comments if you would like to see just a little bit around Amsterdam and... Uh, maybe apartment tour. Apartment tour, life in an Amsterdam, not like really alive, but maybe, is I know, if you're gonna t Google Amsterdam, you're gonna s see that the first thing that comes up is something related to weed yeah. and shrooms <laughs> weed and mushrooms no guys that's not the thing actually <laughs> it, is that what, what, what it's what amsterdam is the most popular with but the per depends on like what you're looking for because you can get also tulips cheese beautiful canals really really nice old town a lot of history so you know it just depends on the interest exactly guys anyhow it's been a while, I hope that you are not mad at us, I hope that you still love us and will not unsubscribe to our channel that we didn't post for so long, but anyhow guys, please, if you're new to the channel, subscribe, like the, like the video, because we will produce more content in the coming weeks, in the coming months, in the coming years, in the, until we die. Oh, okay. <laughs> you promise that, you promise that, you I know they will, keep, they will keep you to your promise, <laughs> they're like, Chris, why are there's no, not, not a new vlog, are you dead? So, <laughs> then I probably I'm gonna be the next vlog. Yeah, well, sorry guys, Chris dead, so you know, I'm just gonna keep vlogging. <laughs> oh my god, those jokes are terrible. Anyhow, guys, sorry again for my waist, sorry for the delay. I hope you enjoyed, I don't know if you enjoyed this small update, but at least you know we're alright, everything's going, everything is happening, and we'll be back on track soon, back traveling, uh, doing all the things that we do, back in Shirgo. We love you guys so much, thank you for sticking around with us and we'll see you in the next video which is definitely gonna be more fun. Ciao! Bye! Good. I think I looked insanely sexy.